Hello, we're back with some more CK2 Game of Thrones, and it, it has been a while. I have, I have basically have not recorded since uploading the videos, because I was too far ahead to where, you know, all the comments, like I see here, the first episode came out four days ago. I recorded the last video five days ago. But now, we're caught up with everything. And uh, there's a couple of things to get to, which, which I'll get into this later. Um, so we've skipped like a year or like a, a half a year. I was trying to assassinate uh, Mr. Jalil so I can take his land because I'm the heir. But instead, we just got a claim on it. We, we've claimed his land, which is good. Because that means we can take his land, and we will do that, and then we will go over here, and, you know, he, he say, he may say, oh, it's okay, oh my god, he wants to fight me, you, wait, what, oh, hey, guys, well, that didn't go as according to planned. Uh, why not? Darn. What, what is she, what has she done to us? Well, we have to go fight that. Or if I kill him, if we still kill him, we are the heir. But, uh, we gotta go raise the men. And uh, get their boats. So since we're not in a time of war and this is a civil war, I actually get all their men. So I can handle their troops efficiently. And not horribly inefficiently like they always tend to do. So let's see, uh, buddy. You got 10k. You have 1k. You got nothing. You got 9k. And you got 3k. So we, we should have this in the bag. Yep, let's go. Move it. By virtue of having dragons. Oh my god. Damn, that is the insane dowry. Whatever. Maybe we shouldn't let them get married, because they, they'll have the blood of the dragon in them. Oh well. Uh, barely educated. No. Not doing any of that anymore. Oh. Should get betrothed. But he's already married, dog. But he wants she wants that matrilineally. And uh that's just that's not happening. Nope. Plus you're a female call, so you'll probably get deposed any day now. Could send for a faceless man. Let's try this. Yeah. Okay. Oh my god. Oh. Get in the boats. Oh my god, they're fighting. Well... He hates us because we tried to assassinate him, but uh, he'll he'll be okay. We're trying to assassinate him again. I'm still his heir. Yeah, I'll travel to a wedding. He probably wants some insane amount of money to do it. Uh, we got dishonorable. So does that make us, people hate us? Dishonor, oh, it goes away eventually. Okay. There we go. That war is over, because I took your land, because I killed you. And you can suck it. So now what we do is we go over here, we go to our cadet dynasty, and we, okay, well, first off, we gotta go, okay. I think we gotta give him Faros, which that should help him defend himself. 
And then we go over here, Kingdom of Morok, and bam, he is a king. And yeah, okay, our son apparently is slowly mastering the sword. Can I force you the train? Has greater. Uh, we only have one, two. Well, that ain't good. Who did you marry? I just married you off to some random dude. Oh well. And you're betrothed to Mr. Call, or called to be. And, uh, I guess they could get married. Why not? There we go. So, uh, now that that's over, I was kind of hoping they would just throw in the towel, but apparently it's another ruined city. So, we got three kingdoms under us. We got the Morok, we got the Basilisk Isles, and we got the Summer Islands. And I guess technically Assyria. But they never help us. They are the most useless vassal ever. They're always fighting each other up here. Which is fine, because he always wants independence. That's his entire life, is spent being independent. Or well, trying to be independent. So, now we gotta go over here. And we got Ancient City of Karth. So now I think I want to go invade Karth. Because Karth will have nobody who will defend them because of their religion. Or we can try to go take over these guys over here. That's a bad. This is also a possibility. And then we can try to go over east and go invade these guys. That's also a possibility. But what I really want to do is I want to take over the these cities. The slave cities. That would be awesome. The problem is that if I attack one, they all band together. And they all attack me. And they got quite a few men. They got some like 40k. Easy. All banded together. So there's no easy way for me to just go attack one of them. So I need to get really strong, and then I'll just take them all down at once. And by at once, I mean just one at a time. But slowly. But I think I want to go take Karth. Because Karth won't have anyone defend it. The problem with Karth that I have is the... Is this right here. This is a problem. Is this whole... Noble oligarchy. Because he'll, he'll dislike us. Like this guy, if we go over here... He dislikes us because... It, there should be different. Yeah, wrong government time. Minus 20. Minus 20. That is insane. But, uh, yeah. But he'll, he'll just have, he just has to live with us. But, um, so. What, what is this? Oh, oh my god, we owe a favor to a billion people. Woo. But, uh, yeah, so. We got that. So now I can get in to the comments. So we can we can start these. So uh, on a lot of these. So let's see. Okay. Uh huh. Yeah. John Ottonian says there should be. Uh, yeah, it says get North Valyria. We already did that. And then there should be. And then we got, uh, John Antonius says, gotta get your wives to like you. Well, yeah. I guess we can't, yeah. You know, we know how that went. We know how this went all too well. Wait, was fed to, okay. Yeah, or dragon. Balon, yeah. Well, you know. Yeah. Yeah. That that's, that basically speaks for itself. Uh huh. And then we got John Otonian says again, "Will you make cadet uh, branches of your house?" Yes. As you see, we've we've already done. So we got that squared away. And we will make more if we can. 
Like, I may want to make Karth the good. If we take over Karth, I'd like to make Karth uh, a dude. A man in charge. That'd be awesome. And so, yeah, Purple Devil says, I think it's good to skip so I don't have to watch all the boring stuff. In my Dorn series, an episode five is like an edited version. The quality is lower, but whenever I get to that, whenever that's released, you can see how that goes. It's just a, a test run to see how things go. But yeah, for the most part, when it comes to editing, I'll probably, you know, just simply not record if... If it's if I need something done, like I wasn't recording until I had a way to take this away, because that was our, our big goal. I was trying to take this guy's land, so that away we don't have these guys under us, because or this guy right here, because he hates us. He he wants me dead. You know what I mean? And this guy too, he wants me dead too. But since they're not above us, they only hate you know our son, and our son loves us because we gave him a king. Made him a king, which is good. And then, yeah, then we could probably go over here and take more of this stuff. We'll do that later. But I think right now the next goal is Karth, but there's still more comments. Uh-huh. Yeah, like I said, I was going to skip Regencies. I think it's good to skip, yeah. Like, I classify boring stuff as, like, if I'm sitting here for, like, ten minutes waiting for a plot to go through so I can kill someone and get their land back for myself. Uh, I don't know who you are. Can I, I can't execute you. Uh. Whatever. If I can't kill you, I'll just free you. So, we got that, and I believe there were some more comments. Let's go check here. Yeah, I'm, I'm just reading. Sorry for the silence. You should try to sell as many slaves as you can so you can fuel your wars by having happier vassals. So I thought about that. The problem with that is I have money, I just don't have the income to fund, like, mercs. So if like, right now, I can basically afford to maintain the army I have raised. And since I don't have any, like, uh, income to, you know, cancel out to be able to fuel said mercs, I'll eventually just go broke. And then selling slaves is just, it's a tedious process. And I like being able to have our, our horde of slaves, you know. But, like, you, we'll, we'll slave, we'll sell you. Yeah, I'll just sell them for five bucks. Yeah. We're not in it for the money. We're in it for the conquest. It's like, you, you, you know, we'll, we'll just sell all these real quick. Whatever. I'll do that off screen. Stuff like that I'll do off screen. Because I'd just be going through the menus. So. That Crusader says, ditch your dragon and ditch Balerian. Or, ditch your dragon and tame Balerian. That was like, I believe that was right before we had our sick dance, you know, Dance of the Dragons and our super dragon, Killigan, over here, 1v1'd his uh, or her mom, Elenixes, destroyed Elenixes, obviously. Wait, was slain by Lifefire? What? I could have sworn we killed it. Whatever, we, we got it. I think we may have maimed him. Who knows? But I could have sworn we got him. But, uh, yeah. So we got, you know, our super dragon. And I like the storyline with our dragon. You know what I mean? I like, you know, we have a character who grew up with their dragon. That's awesome. Hopefully the same thing will happen to our heir. Hopefully he won't die trying to get that. But if, if he does, we have other sons. We have Raycar over here, and then we have the series. So that's good. And our wife is Priggers. So then we can go on to the rest, okay? Yeah, you should imprison. So here's. Uh, you should imprison your sister wife and enslave her so you can force her. Yeah, if you still want her, because she can claim. Yeah, she can. Yeah, well. This is a long comment. 
Right, here, let me let me pull this up. Okay. Uh, yeah, she has a claim to a throne. She has a dragon, as Purple Devil says. Well, well, yeah, you know, this is another one of those. Uh, you know, we can't we can't enslave her. I thought about that like immediately after I executed her, but. From a roleplay standpoint, I feel like at that point, we're just done with her. Just feed her to the dragon. Feed her to the machine. And, uh, yeah. Those are the comments. So as, you know, the comments come in, I'll be able to read them. It's just sometimes I'm ahead of where the video is. You know, we are in the series, but that is that. And yes, I think our next step is taking Karth. It'll be a pain to keep Karth because it's a noble oligarchy. But, uh, screw it. Let's do it. We do it. Embargo. Ooh, we could get a lot of money, but we don't care about that. We're not in it for the money. I want the conquest. So I wonder, if can I just sit here and will my vassals take over for me? Because that would be kick-ass. What? Oh, we're, we're at some random place. Yeah. I don't care. Uh-huh. But Okay, so apparently we're at a Dothraki wedding. Did you you died. Wow. Mingo. Rip. Cool. So they're all fighting. Yeah, you know, we're we're just we're just simple bystanders, just watching. You know, what's happening? The bizarreness of these barbarians and their weddings. But that's fine. Our our daughter shall live a happy life. She can go. She can go conquest. You know, take over things too. Okay, I think we're actually gonna need to take our army. Maybe, because our, our vassals are getting their asses handed to them at the moment. So yeah, let's do it. It really makes me wonder if I should have just turned off the uh, setting that... Um... Uh, what? Who are you? What, what do you want? Stormslinger, what would you think he's... He's fine. Plus he's the son of our vassal, so he's our, our future vassal. And uh, we don't we don't want to kill our vassals. Oh no, we don't have enough boats to get everybody over. You know what, can I build some more boat, boat stuff? Castle Shipyard, I need a Castle Town 1. Could I build boats somewhere else? Oh well. There we go. Oh, Aethon, he has a dragon too. What kind of dragon do you have? You have the best dragon of all of us. Okay. Well, we're gonna be down some men. But what we lack in men, we make up for in dragons. Uh, there we go. Yeah. Let's just go sail our boats. Uh, trade route. Is 
Is that for me or like what what is the demon pass? I I don't see this. That can be worth 200 gold. Too expensive. Don't care, buddy. Yeah, I guess. Once the tutor or ward. Who is our ward? Who are you? I don't even know who you are. No. Can I like, send you off somewhere? I don't. I don't care about. I don't care. You can do whatever you want. Ooh, Samela, she's quick. Now that is something I like to see. Now, how's our uh, how's the military doing? Bam! Destroyed them. We gotta move, cause oh god, attrition. Oh god, attrition. Oh god, they moved to the same spot as we did. Who are you? Yeah. Oh god, we ta we've tacked these guys right as they got hit by it with some kind of crazy gray plague. Jeez. Woo. That messed us up. That's all fine. Karth can't stand our might. Eventually they will learn that. Are you standing on me now? Why Why are you... I can't believe you've done this. I can't believe you've done this, man. Why Why do this to me? Can't you see I'm kind of currently standing here? Do I have these guys on... Just hunt enemies. Stop. That, stop standing on me. Ooh, our son. Named the He-Dragon. Limigon. Cool. Please don't die. I, mean, I guess someone else can tame your dragon for you. Look at you go, Maylor. So where is our... Who's our next oldest? Oh, we, we actually don't have that many. Yeah, why not? So if we go up one... I have to have some kind of, yeah, I have like a bastard brother. Can I give you, I can give him a cadet dynasty. Huh. He has no kids, though. Half brother. I could give it to him. Uh, anyone else? Yes, you. You have a dragon? Makar. Could give it to him. He's a dragon rider. He'd be really good at fighting. I think he's the one. Well, actually, now that I say that, I actually don't want to give it to him. Because he'd be really good at fighting me. And I don't want him to be really good at fighting me. I don't want to fight him. Oh, well. Cool. Oh, no. Just... Yeah, I don't, I don't care. So now we gotta go siege Karth. No. I don't care about trade routes. They don't matter to me. We're still depressed. Athon, he is gone to go take his own. Look at that, see? Don't need it. He doesn't need me. Uh, can I employ my dragon? Apparently not. Bam. 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 Actually, can I get someone else to employ their dragon? I don't... I don't want to actually do it myself. But I guess we will. Oh! Oh, wait, no. Okay. Woo! 
Some goofball tried to stand up to our dragon. That was the last mistake he ever made. So now that all of their lands are just destroyed, go siege. Yeah. That's what you guys need to do. Because uh, we've already destroyed their army. Don't know where it is. But uh, it's been destroyed. Wherever it may hide. I don't care. Oh my god, the freaking... Hey, what, what are you guys doing? You're independent now? I mean, I guess I could just take them over later. It's not really all that big of a deal. Yeah, get, get stronger. Get diligent, dude. Heck yeah. Go you, you're number one. Okay, guys, you, I guess I gotta... Wait. How are you independent now? Athon? Aw. Oh. He's inbred, and there's really no way we can cure that. Well, we'll take care of that in time. Come on. We've lost a lot of men in this war. More than I'd like to lose. Yeah. It's our wife. Yeah, I want her to fall in love with us. Of course. Come on, this, this is it. This is the end of the war. Yeah, I have ever reward, man. There you go. Bam! So I didn't get your, your title. Somehow... But, oh yeah, we just vassalized him. Never mind. Okay. And I'm going to end the episode there. Yeah, so stay tuned to next time and see what we do next. Until then, take care.